Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to some more no money spent man I am a little late to this no money spent as you guys can see it is season three We are a few days into season three now I did actually record this video already and I like opened some packs and shit like that And I went over a bunch of things, but uh, I didn't really like the way the video turned out I didn't really like the way the gameplay turned out either So I just said fuck it I'm gonna do a little bit of grinding and then uh, record the video My initial plan was I was gonna try my absolute hardest to get as many new trophy case cards as I could and it just didn't work out that way at all <laughs> but uh before we get into the video man if you guys enjoy this kind of stuff don't forget to hit that like button and if you are new hit that subscribe button man it'll help me out a ton but let's get right into this video starting off with the season agenda man really quickly i just want to show where i'm at i am sitting at level 25 and i haven't even tried to do xp grinding yet they're just tossing out xp at this point man i matched up against a dude who already has trey young and i think we are three days into this fucking season which is nuts but uh we are sitting at level 25 uh, we just got our elite franchise moment exchange and we're working our way up man we're working our way up pretty nicely we are on the final tier of the ascension board which does have a pink diamond josh smith so i'm hoping i can actually get that card because uh, i would use them but this is where i'm standing at the season agenda man level 25 maybe next episode i'll be level 40 I doubt it, but maybe the next episode will be level 40. And one really nice thing, though, about this agenda is you do actually get a centerpiece at level 39. Showing off the trophy case, I am super close to getting another pink diamond. Really, really close. I just need a rare franchise exchange, and I can't find one right now. I can't get one. I screwed up when I had a rare one, and I picked the wrong team and i didn't end up i fucked myself out of getting steve nash for this episode and i really wanted steve nash for this episode but we are one card away from getting ourselves our pink diamond steve nash we are getting super close to galaxy opal anthony davis uh then we're gonna move on and complete the clippers collection get ourselves this elton brand once i'm done that i got seven out of 15 on the kings and seven out of 15 on the golden state warriors once we complete these guys galaxy opal anthony davis will be home there's tons of centerpieces available right now i don't i get the dark matter by the end of this season dark matter would probably come either next season or the season after i'm gonna say next season for the dark matter i should be able to complete at least this beat this division and get myself that opal anthony davis that's at least the goal for the end of the season finally man to show off the goat squad to start off season three i know it's not the start but i'm gonna show the team off and then we're gonna get hot right into some unlimited The first card I want to go over and highlight is Galaxy Opal Paul George. I'm going to throw, uh, throw up on screen how much I paid for him. I believe it was 220 k And when I saw him going for that price, I was like, that is perfect. This is the card I've been waiting to try and buy and just completely badge out. I've been wanting to just get one really expensive card and badge it out. And Paul George is perfect. He's the only Galaxy Opal available on the market right now. He's going to become rare. And I've already started badging mine out. Uh, so I put a shoe on mine, made him very... Very, very nice defensively with the shoe 97 steel 87 interior he has a 91 speed uh, speed with ball with a 96 excel and 97 lateral quickness so the shoe i put on him was pretty nice and getting into his badges he has 15 hall of fame badges and 32 gold uh, i went ahead and gave him clutch shooter which is a pretty decent badge it's nothing crazy uh, i also went ahead and gave him volume shooter which is a really good badge uh, and i gave him hall of fame rebound chaser because he does play my four uh, and then as for the gold badges i went ahead and gave him uh space creator i believe on gold and then I know I gave him, and I also gave him Boxo Beast on Gold. Now I'm still looking to really badge this card out. I still got some Hall of Fame packs from, or I should have some Hall of Fame badges coming up from both the seasons past playing Unlimited and stuff like that. And then I am going to sell this Paul George and I'm looking to hopefully make about 1 million MT, bro. There's no way if I fully badge out this Paul George, he doesn't sell for at least a mil. But we got Paul George on the squad, and this card is absolutely insane. The next new card I got was 96 overall glitched pink diamond Hakeem Olajuwon. The way I got this card was I got him through the 250k tournament locker code. I got super lucky with this Hakeem card uh, and got him. Unfortunately, I didn't get the John Wall card. But Hakeem Olajuwon was the card I wanted, and this card is absolutely insane. Uh, as for Hakeem, I just threw on a shoe for him, and it really just boosted up his defense a little bit more, and his speed and uh, vertical. 
I didn't really want to boost his anything on offensively, really, because he's not really lacking offensively. I could have boosted his three ball, maybe even his free throw dunk, driving dunk, but that shit wasn't really important. And as for badges, I didn't throw any badges on him, so he's coming with his standard badges, but uh, this card is an extremely good card, man, and I'm super pumped that we got him. But this is what the squad's looking like to start off season three. Let's get right into some unlimited. We are 1-0 in unlimited, and I didn't actually know this, but we're going to get a trophy case option pack. Maybe that contains the exchange card I I need to get myself our pink diamond steve nash so hopefully he's there but really quickly i'm just gonna go over all the rewards you got 15 tokens another trophy case event card prize ball shoe pack 200 tokens uh, unlimited badge pack i really really want this the centerpiece at 6,000 is standard another option pack 75 tokens diamond prize ball another set of tokens sydney moncrief 20k mt another exchange in unlimited which i really want so that's pretty cool some more hall of fame badges the fire 10 pack box which is like a must get man if you pack pink diamond Giannis, dude it's that's a lot of MT. Uh, then the takeover pack, which is cool, but like whatever. Uh, 125 tokens, another pink diamond prize ball, 20 KMT, 250 tokens, 25 KMT, 500 tokens, another Hall of Fame option pack, and the fire 20 pack box. So I'm going to do my best to actually complete unlimited because this is probably the best unlimited board they've, they've had so far this year. So I'm going to do my best, but let's get right into this game. All right, let's see what this record's looking like. He's 26 and 26. Doesn't have the greatest record. That Galaxy Opal Anthony Davis is a little concerning. I'm not going to lie. I don't know how Paul George is going to handle it, but it should be good, bro. Come on. Quick stop here. Start the game off. Defense sets the tone, you dig? Come on. That's good, D. Get that shit out of here, bro. Look at this dude. Paul George, bro, that was nice, dude. The Euro. I know I do that a lot, but goddamn, that was that was clean. That was a clean one. Hang, dude. PG. Let's go, man. We have a big game from PG. That'd be so hype. No, get over there. Good D, Hakeem. Hell yeah. All right, there's 2:30 left here in the second quarter. I got my bench in. I need a very good screen here from KG. We're going to find Rudy in the corner. I don't know where you're going, bro, but Rudy's taking flight. All right. I don't know how D-Book is going to match up against Ron Artest, but hopefully we can sauce the fuck out of him. Hey, let's go. He did it. Let's go. D-Book has to be my favorite card, man. Ah. Uh... Come on, bro. This guy's weak ass offense, man. We got this shit completely clamped up, bro. Are you sure about that? Come on now. Yep. There the whole way. Suck my ass. Come on. Don't let no. All right, it is the start of the second quarter. I am getting my ass kicked. I'm going to shoot it from right here with Paul George and green it. Uh-oh, retard alert. Thank you. Come nice. again. Up to PG. No, I didn't want to shoot that. It's okay. Hakeem's got me, though. Run this way. Snatch back. Cross over. It didn't go up. What the fuck? Is this is low-key a mismatch. Off the inbound, PG. Oh my god, bro, I'm building a school. I just simply can't get shit to go right now. Yep, just take my screen like it doesn't mean nothing. Shoot the ball! Why does everything take three years? How the fuck do any of his starters have any fucking energy, bro? They've been running for an hour. Thank you. Come again. That's great, D. Oh, 
Why the fuck were we behind him? Two very boring minutes later. Come on. I can't have shit. Bruh. The fuck is happening? Come on, I need that three. Let's go. Jesus Christ, man. This is where the comeback starts. This dude's got his bench on. We Why are we leaving him wide open? What the fuck was Garnett doing? What the fuck is happening? Please, team. I need you guys to not be autistic right now. Not be like, look, the book showed up. I need the rest of these fuckers to show up, man. They're all still on the plane. go kg come on man we're, we're starting to we're starting to make a dent in this lead right now come on all right come on i need a good screen here big shot in feed let's go man 13 point game just need another stop yo booker is nuts let's fucking go bro booker's bringing me back in this game good d That's good DMP! No! Come on, book. Hang, let's get it. And I'm completing challenges. Come on, dude. I just need to string together a few stops. Nice. No way we let Steve Nash finish that weak ass layup in bead. No fucking way. Show! You won't let me shoot! <laughs> Yo, come on, man. I'm actually getting screwed right now. This is fucked up. Stop fucking with me. Homie isn't having any issue shooting. Get the fuck. <laughs> Embiid! What are you doing? Why the fuck are you just the- Oh my god, bro. Later. Bruh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the- Well, I'm 1-2 and two on the season, which is cool. My other loss came from an error code, so... Maybe some good came out of this, though. Hopefully, the exchange card that I need is sitting in this and we can get ourselves Steve Nash. At least something good will come out of this video. Well, a little bit of good came out of this video, I guess. We are going to get to lock in our Steve Nash. Maybe he'll be on the squad next episode. I don't know if this card actually makes this team. Just because Steve Nash can't sh uh, dunk for shit. Taking a look here at this Steve Nash's stats, man. 99 offense, 89 defense. He is 6'3". He has a 94 three ball, no dunking. Good ball handle. Obviously, his passing is crazy good. 85 steal with an 85 perimeter. 25 interior defense, meaning he won't do fuck all once he gets posted up. Uh, 94 speed. That's pretty low. Honestly, this Steve Nash is a little underwhelming, if I'm being completely honest. What are his badges looking like? Hall of Fame catch shoot. He's got the dimer, hyperdrive, killer combos, mismatch, special delivery, unpluckable. His gold agent threes, guard up, volume shoot. Does he not have limitless? Clamp breaker, handles for days, quick first step. Silver, uh, he's got silver limitless, pick dodger. So he needs some badges. I don't know if this card makes my team, but he definitely needs some badges. I'd probably give him anchor. But we do have Steve Nash on the team. And matter of fact, I'm actually going to sell this Rudy Gay. And we're going to put this pink diamond Gordon Hayward in the lineup. And take a look at the squad, man. Pink diamond or higher if I keep Steve Nash in the lineup. This is pretty lit, man. Only season three of my team, and this is where my no money spent squad's looking like. Let me know in the comment section below what your no money spent squad's looking like. But I think that's going to do it for today's episode. I'll catch you guys in the next one.